Hi guys, this is Pedram Bedhendi, owner of the property at 72 Canyon Street. We came out here today to produce a video uh, and to take some exact measurements to show where our property line ends, uh, show the characteristics of this particular section of the belt line and where it meets our property line. I definitely have a newfound appreciation for survey people, being that we've only been out here for 40 minutes and we're dripping with sweat and uh, poked by lots of thorns and branches. Okay, so we are standing here at the rear of the property line. This uh, orange broomstick is precisely lined up with the uh, iron pin set by the survey company that took the uh, original property survey. The setback is 20 feet and the variation that we've requested is 12 feet. We've marked both 12 feet back and 20 feet back very precisely. And I cannot even imagine a hypothetical scenario in which our garage being built 12 feet back from our property line would disturb future belt line development and our garage being 20 feet back from our property line would not disturb future belt line development. Primarily because here on the west side, there's less than six feet of space between the edge of the cement path and our rear property line, making it highly unlikely the belt line would ever want to do anything on this side. Now we are on the other side of the path. And on this side of the path, there is 41 feet of space between the cement path and I imagine where the belt lines property ends. Thank you for taking the time to look at our video and uh, hopefully we've uh, uh, made our case that uh, allowing us to build a little bit closer, uh, still further back from than the original uh, seven feet setback required by our, our five zoning uh, will, will not in any way uh, disturb current or future plans by the belt line. Thank you.